father made all sorts of plans. But father's very enthusiastic about a tour of South America. Have your folks made their plans yet, Audrey? Well, if everything turns out as we planned, I expect we'll go to California. But of course, I practically serve an ultimatum on the family that I will not endure another summer at Newport. I don't blame you, my dear. The place is becoming simply impossible. Hello, I'm Miss Rooney, Annie Rooney. I don't think I've had the pleasure. You're Stella Bainbridge, aren't you? I've heard Marty speak of you. Really? You know Martin well? Oh, yes, we're great friends. I see where Mrs. J. Townsend Wellington's chestnut gelding won the fourth gated class at the Piping Rock Show. Wasn't it just too thrilling? Are you interested in horses, Miss Rooney? Of course, Audrey, you know, Father sold our Newport place years ago. Oh, by the way, are you going back to Mrs. Spence's school next fall? Well, I really can't make up my mind. And Mother and Father haven't decided just where I should go. Who is she? I haven't the slightest. I've never seen her before. Annie Rooney. Mrs. J. Townsend, who's his chestnut gelding? <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't it priceless? <laughs> Shall we go down? Oh, yes, the boys are probably frothing at the mouth. <laughs> <laughs> such a thing. Changing things at the last moment, and all on account of a whim of young Master Martin's. Perching at a table is tempting providence, that's what it is. I met your friend, Miss Rooney. She introduced herself. She did? Yes. She seems quite interested in horses. She is? Why, don't you know? Oh, yes, yes, of course. Excuse me. Gee, I thought you were never coming down. I got stuck with that Stella Bainbridge. Is she a drizzle puss? What's the matter? Headache? Kind of. But you'll dance, won't you? I'd love to. 